I am throwing together a quick mini series on how to use my fitness pal. I've had a couple new clients for the new year who have never used it, so I thought I'd take this opportunity and kind of give an overview of how to use it to hopefully lessen the burden and not, I don't want you to be overwhelmed, okay? You will become a master within a couple weeks, maybe even after this video, hopefully. So my fitness pal is a food tracking app and it's a great tool to have with you when you are trying to reach a goal, whether that be muscle gain or fat loss. You can kind of see what you're eating, how many calories and macros you're eating a day. I have given you as your coach a set of macros or maybe I've just given you protein to track. So this is how you can track that fairly easily. Some benefits of food journaling and keeping track on MyFitnessPal are like, I okay, so you'll get a better estimate of what you're eating daily. You'll know whether you're going over or under your macros. So if you're overeating or under eating, why you may stall and wait, things like that. And then I love journaling. So you won't have to journal forever. You'll have to do it for a little bit. And then one day you won't need to use it. You will kind of know what is in the food you're eating because you have done it previously. So I journaled for a couple years and like you could show me a plate of food and I could have a pretty good idea of what that food looks like. It also makes you weigh your food and measure your food. So you also get an idea of like what six ounces of meat looks like, what two cups of vegetables looks like, things like that. So that's why food journaling is very, very beneficial because it is a tool that it, it helps, it sets you up for your future and you won't have to do it forever. I just wanna in, like throw that in your brains now. It's not a forever thing. Just while you're starting out, getting the hang of things. Usually while you're sort of going toward the goal, especially when it comes to weight loss, it's very, very helpful to have. So definitely a great place to get started. Okay, if these come out, just know, cap my back, cause freaking filming is so stressful. On to the next video. I will see you guys and, oh, no. <laughs> Let's talk. So what you're gonna do first, and I'm not gonna walk you through the steps because I think everybody gets to this point and then kind of doesn't know what to do next. You're gonna go to the app store and download the MyFitnessPal app and create your user account. You can do this on a desktop as well, but I highly recommend you get the app on your phone as well. So when you are on the go, you can use it. So you're gonna download that and you're gonna create a user account. You can connect it to your Facebook or you can use your email and set up a password. So do that and then I'll see you in the next video.